Hey everybody, welcome back to my 30 Days to Die series. It is the morning of day 12. And uh, so I had to look for those supplies last night. And if we go downstairs here real quick, there's a couple zombies outside, so I'm trying to stay quiet. I don't want them breaking in while um, there is still uh, nighttime because they will be runners. Yeah, he's moaning out there. Whoa. Anyway, so I found the supplies. And, you know, it was in a weird kind of spot. But, um, you know, it was one of those things where I never, places where I never even thought to look. It was telling me it was on the ground floor. And I'll show you the reason why here in a second once we get downstairs. Two more minutes and we'll walk it down. I won't be afraid of the zombies anymore. Switch over to the club. Here we go. All right, so I decided, see, told you, um, I dug through the floor here and it was right here on top of the, um, I hear you guys out there. It was on top of the uh, cooler downstairs. So if we go down to the basement here, um, I looted everything. It's right up there. It was saying it was on the main floor, but it wasn't. It was in the basement. So, you know, what do you do, right? All right, let's get out of here. Now, I locked this. I closed this door last night. Oh. What's up, girl? I heard these two all night, and I was afraid they were going to hear me. So I tried to stay as quiet as possible. Yeah, he's breaking in over here. Let's get this guy. And then we'll start heading back. We are pretty much overloaded. Hey, buddy, what's up? All that work to get inside, and I was right out here. So I was uh, checking out the uh, the Fun Pimps um, uh, sort of review of Alpha 18. It's looking pretty cool. I got to say, they got a lot of new weapons, a lot of new game mechanics. It's pretty awesome. Uh, I can't wait for it to come out. I will most likely end this series, like I said, at day 30. Once the horde hits us, but then I'll probably be picking up an Alpha 18 series. I'm not going to try and run two at one time like I did with this one. I'm just going to do one. Because I'll probably be playing Rogue Tech at that time as well, too. So, uh, as soon as that gets up and running. Alright, just picked up a little more concrete before we go back home. we got a little bit of time before the trader opens anyway, so... Figure we might as well get a little bit more while we're out here. Now, I did change my shirt, too. I had a, a, a t-shirt on, which was great for the desert, but not so good for the cold. So we picked up a, uh, a uh, sweater. Um, so I put that on. It's giving us a bit of cold resistance here, which is nice. Gave us seven more cold resistance. Let's see if we can get some speed up and hit this guy. See how, how, how well a bicycle does against a lumberjack here. Ah, about as good as the motorcycle, I guess. Okay, let's go home. We'll drop this stuff off. Then we'll go back to the trader and see if we can pick up another mission. See if we got some stuff to sell. It is day 12. We got one more day before they restock, so we won't really find anything until they, they restock. Ah, getting here. Oh, the trees look like they're growing pretty well here. I, I hope they're at uh, the max level here. 1,200 hit points. That would be nice to be able to chop those down and get some good wood off them. It's nice to be able to not have to leave the compound to go get wood. All right, let's put this stuff away. Yeah, so I converted all the flagstone block and or flags the um, cobblestone into flagstone blocks, so we don't have to do it later. All right, let's put the stuff away. All right, now let's grab some stuff that we can just sell. Um, let's hang on to these. What's this one? Three nine. This one is three nine. Yeah, tank top doesn't look as good. Oh, we got the hooded sweatshirt. You know what? Let's put this on. It's a little better than what we've got now. We'll just sell this one. Um, I mean, I don't know if we'll need all this, but we're going to keep some of them. Uh, baseball, well, we don't really need. We've, we've got our extra hooded sweater. We can sell that. All right, trader's open. Uh, what do we got in here? Uh, I'm going to leave the guns for now. Let's sell the hunting knives. I don't think he's going to buy the guns. Let's sell the steel ammo. Uh, we can sell these two. Uh, let's sell this guy, because chances are he'll buy that. Let's take our coins. We're going to visit the other trader, too, and see what he's got for us. Um, yeah, so I think that's about it. we got some more steel ammo here. 44 Magnum steel. we sell those? Yeah, I don't foresee us using a Magnum, so let's just sell those. We'll keep the regular ammo. 
Um, yeah, I think that's pretty good for now. Don't need two of these. Um, yeah, okay, let's go. Bikes outside. Back to a bit of speed again. Alright, I'm just gonna leave the bike there. I know I normally bring it in, but I don't hear any zombonies around, so we should be fine. Here is your reward. Well, yeah, thank you. Oh, steel pickaxe. You kidding me? And Molotovs. Tasting him. We already got that one, right? Yeah, we got that one. 15 Molotovs. Level 3 machete. We don't need it because we got a level 6 knife. Iron chest armor is kind of nice too. But I want to stay light. Let's take the... Uh, yeah, let's just take this one. Um... What about your inventory here? Let's sell some stuff. Cowboy hats. Gatch. Aline. You'll buy all these. You'll buy all these. And all these. This guy. Wire tool. Okay. Steel pickaxe. That's nice. Um, now I think I got the ergonomic grip on this. Yeah, I cheat. I... Um, found another die, so I put it on our bow here, and I took the grip off the bow. Um, so let's just... Gratitude, gratitude to you, too. Uh, so let's modify this, take the ergonomic grip off this sucker, and modify this, and we'll put it on this guy. Okay, cool. Um, I'm gonna hang on to that, though. You know what I should do, then? Let's buy some forged... You got a lot of forged steel. I'm gonna buy, like, three... Just so that we can repair that. Um, laser sight too. Do we want that? Firearm or crossbow. We can put it on the pistol. We probably should buy that. Um, gives us a bit more mobility. But not worried about that right now. Yeah I think that's probably good. And we're going to go down to the other trader. Of guy weapon flashlight now. Nah. Y'all come back now. You hear? All right. Um, let's modify this guy. Get the muzzle brake already on there. Take this on there. Sure. Works for me. Yeehaw! Let's go see that trader. Okay, it looks pretty quiet here, but we're going to bring our bike in anyway. Surely just leave my helmet light on all the time. I'm like, I need to buy batteries. Your business, yeah, you, you're always crusty. Got any jobs? What do we got here? Ooh, clear zombies. 500 and something meters. I've got just the job for a simp. Can't say I'm not surprised. What do you got? You got anything good for us? Night vision goggles, switches, shotgun choke, weapon flashlight, um, munitions box, a lot of cool stuff for just the uh, decoration stuff. A lot of armor too. Tool and die set. Um, I don't think there's anything here that we definitely have to have. Uh, Stocks on day 13. He's got a tool and die set in here as well. Structural brace. This gives us durability. Sawed off shotgun barrel. Increases projectile spread. I'm a shotgun. Uh, I'm going to buy this. And we're going to put that. Sale is a sale. It is a sale. To a like you. Well, you're such a nice guy. We're going to put it in here. Just someone we're mining. It lasts a lot longer. Oh, we're going straight ahead. Alright, let's get the bike out. Let's do this. Ah, I really hate that I can't put the bike down on their property. Alright, we're getting close here. Let's just hop off the bike. Wow, it uh, fell over on the stuff and broke it. Alright, let's just hop off the bike. Wow. Get a little bit of XP, see if we can find some bird's nest before we get there. There's one. Yeah. So it's this building right up here, eh? Let's 
God, the physics. Oh, too tired. Well, you went down like a sack of potatoes. Is that a cracker book? Oh, it's a cracker book. Guess where we're going today, guys. All right, let's go clear this building first. It's a tier two, so it's probably going to be a big job. Uh, looks like it's going to be the uh, all those cabinets here. Is this all those cabinets? It looks like it is. All right, fun times. Yep, it is. Okay, I wonder if I should... Yeah, you know what we need? Do I have stones on me? I do. Let's go ahead and make as many arrows as we can. Ten, eh? Wow. That's just wonderful. We got 50-something. Is that going to be enough? I don't know. Let's see if we can find a bird's nest real quick. Here we go. Another 13. That should probably be enough. Is there another nest over there? Yep, there is. One more. Let's just make sure. Another 14. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, let's get those moving. All right, the one right here, too. Ooh, hello there. All right, here we go. All those cabinets. All those, all those cabinets. Wow, like everything just disappeared here. I guess because it's not really in its natural biome. Oh, there's a guy way over there. All right, let's have some fun with this, guys. Better load this sucker up. We got the die in here now, so we're doing a bit more damage, which is nice. I can't shoot down there, I know that. Should probably turn this light off, because it's going to give us away if we're close, but whatever. we got to get way over, because this thing hangs over the edge. Yeah. Getting a little better with getting the headshots on this now. Don't know if that fire zombie is going to make his way over here, though. Okay, I don't see anything up here. Got somebody in there. Nobody back here. I'm going to pick up our arrow, though. Oh, this is a big boy. Let's go get our arrow. Come on, big boy. What's up, yo? Oh, we missed you. Ooh. Okay, we're going to loot afterwards. Okay, did our arrow end up somewhere where we could get it? Nope, I guess not. Okay, this is outside. Okay, now I know we can shoot through the table here. Oh, that's got to hurt. Ooh. There we go. She ain't done. Now she done. Anybody else over here? Okay. Wish we could just take these. They gotta make a way that you can disassemble them and bring them. They should have a skill. Some kind of mechanic skill that allows you to disassemble stuff like that. And then just make them extremely, like, non-broken ones extremely rare. What's up, Mo? I rarely see Mo go down with one headshot. Shot to the pills, though. Nice way to finish them off. Okay, we got a workbench in here, too. I'm gonna wrench this, I think. Yeah, it's destroyed. So we're gonna wrench it before we go, if I remember correctly. So I think we're gonna need to go out in the roof, too, if I'm not mistaken with this one, because there's vultures out there, and they're probably gonna count. Wow. Okay, not too bad up here. One of the things I did notice, though, in the uh, in 1.8 is it looks like the zombies, um, it looks like as they get closer to you, they'll move faster. So if they're walking, they'll get right up on you, and then all of a sudden they start moving fast. 
So if you got like three or four of them coming up on you, they, you could get swarmed really quickly if you're not careful. All right, what do we got in here before this thing despawns? Some water. Some water. We'll take it though. Not that we need it, but water in the apocalypse is like gold. Okay. Wish we had a silencer. And that's why. Okay, let's take that. I'm gonna take this rock here. Because we used a bunch of oh well, hello there. See ya. Because we used a bunch of stone to get some arrows. Let's make as much noise as we can. Oh, of course, here comes a freaking wandering horde. Let's finish these guys up if we can quickly. Okay, there's still somebody here. I hope these guys don't see me. Please be the last one. Nope. Uh, who's left here then? <gasps> we gotta go up there. Of course we do. Tell you what. I'm gonna use our skill as an archer here. Yeah, they're going to try and... Ah, they're already in here. Oh, shut up, you guys. Give me a second to clear this building and I'll come down and talk to you. Okay, there's got to be somebody up over here. Yep. Right. Chia. That's not it. Listen to them down there. There's people in here. Yep. Okay, let's hope these two guys are the last two. Uh, no, I want this, please. Nope. We got Shaky Boy. What's up, buddy? Looks like you had too much moonshine. There we go. Oh. And you know what? I never knew there was stuff up here. Nice. What else do we got here? Okay. I don't hear them anymore. They are down there. Oh, God. Really, all we, all we want is that workbench. You know, we could probably wrench one of the... Um, take those... Uh, you know, we can sell the sham. Oh, they're breaking all the stuff down there. Guys, come on! Stomp. Stomp eat. Whoop! Well, I did not expect that to happen. Alright, let's get out here. Deal with these guys. We've got a party going on out here. Look at them all showing them up. Showing them up. Showing up. Guys, I'm over here. Dude. Ooh, you paid for that. Really? Ah! They're upstairs. You're breaking all the stuff I want. Here you come. Come on. Come on. You sound tired. Here. Go to sleep. Alright, now there was a big mama too. Where did she go? 
Oh, here's another one. Where's Big Mama? Don't see her anywhere. I did see her sauntering over here, though. Oh, what do we got here? Some berries. Well, maybe she's upstairs. Okay, well, we're going to loot. Let's loot this place, see what we got. Sure, she'll sneak up on us at any the most inappropriate time. All those cabinets. This is actually not a bad POI to loot early in the game because of all these cabinets. You can find food and water and stuff in here. Jars. It's really important. Okay, what do we got? Some money. Cha-ching. Cha-ching. Thank you, buddy. Grain alcohol. Okay, I heard some shuffling. I don't know whether that's outside or where that is. Let's close this door. Oh, not that it matters because they, uh... Okay. <laughs> Whatever. All right, nothing in there. Nothing there. Every cabinet, cabinet holds a surprise. All right, let's just dig some of this up. All right, now let's grab the workos benchos. Actually, what don't we need here? We're going to need to get rid of some stuff. Let's just eat this. We're down on stamina a little bit. And, uh, yeah. Alright, let's wrench this. Should probably loot it first. Yeah, for a whole lot of nothing. It's mostly for the forged iron we want. So now we can scrap all these. Okay, that'll work. Uh, what else do we got to loot here? This. Eh. You don't really need the glass. Strangely enough, I just kind of discovered that I can actually melt sa sand in the forge to get glass. I was making bulletproof glass on my other series, and I'm like, wow, it takes forever to find glass. And then I realized that I could just melt sand. Durr. Uh, cupboard? What do we got? Ah, cornmeal. Okay. Nothing there. Some of this. All right, that looks like it's about it. Um... I was thinking about wrenching the, um, we got some guys coming in here too. I was thinking about wrenching the, uh, one of these guys. Because there's two here. Got a couple zombies coming up on us too over here outside. It seems like all these sawmills that I've found, um, all of them are functioning. It's rare to find one that's not. Yeah, there's no way to pick it up either, which really sucks. I'll get you in a second, buddy. Alright, we're not going into the Cracker Book because, damn, we have no space. So, let's tell you what. Let's head back. We'll drop all this shiz off. Let's get this first. Drop all the stuff off. Go back to the house. Drop stuff off the house. Um, what do we got here? Now we can scrap that. Uh, what else can we scrap here? Let's scrap these. Let's ditch this. We'll take the duct tape. What are you doing? Dude, I'm right here. Come on, buddy. And batter up. Swing batter. Yeah, so Alpha 18 has got an M60 machine gun, which is awesome. If you don't know what an M60 is, it's just basically... Uh, um, it's a light machine. Well, it's an Ellen. Like, it's a, basically a light machine gun, but it's belt fed. It's not like the submachine gun where you just hold it in your hand. It's a big, it's a big ass weapon, relatively heavy. You can carry it and fire it, although you have to have strength to do that. You're better off mounting it on a tripod or using a bipod or something with it. But in this case, it's it's handheld. All right, we're gonna leave the bike outside. Let's get in here, get this quest turned in. We've got a ton of skill points to uh, get rid of too. 
So we have to do that at some point. Uh, yeah. Let's find out. Yeah. I guess I'm gonna have to pay. You I guess you are. Oh, pipe bombs. Herbal antibiotics recipe. Eh. Leather level three leather armor. We want some pipe bombs. 310 explosion damage. Let's take the pipe bombs, because why not? Alright, what do you got? Can we sell some stuff here? Um, you want that? Yeah, I want that. No? Got a level 6 pistol now. We can sell all these guys. What else can we sell? Shotgun choke we'll hang on to. We don't need the flashlight. Um, I'm sure I'm missing something here to sell. I should just sell this. 177. You know what? Let's hang on to it. Um, yeah, we'll leave it. Uh, you know what? Yeah, leave it at that. Whoop, what did I just sell? Shit, I sold the act, pickaxe, didn't I? I did. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Yeah, fuck you two. Damn it. I hit W thinking I was closing the window. Command W on a Mac is uh, close window. And I do it all the time at work. Uh, it's just a habit of mine. Command W, Command W, Command W. I have my finger on the W key, and I'm like, oh yeah, Command W, close window. Whoops, no. Command W, or W, sell. Alright guys, we are going to take the pipe bombs with us this time, because pipe bombs. Um, and I think we're okay with the pistol. How much ammo do we have on us? we got shotgun rounds on us. Why do I have shotgun rounds on me? I think we had a shotgun at one point in time that I was keeping on me, but don't need that. Um, how are we doing for food here? Do we have more bacon and eggs? Did I not make any more? I did not. Let's eat some pears. Gonna have a... Oh, great. Food poisoning. Let's eat them all and get rid of them. Two. Three. Uh, we have any antibiotics here? We do. Let's use this. And let's use this. I'm going to take two of these as well. And we'll use this. Give us a lot of water because that antibiotic is going to drop our water. Okay, I think we're ready to go. This should be interesting, guys. I'm really looking forward to hopefully not dying. Cracker books, 4 o'clock, which means we got to have this place cleared. And hopefully, uh, we can stay there the night. I'm sure I can just make it to the roof and stay there. I'd like to find some good schematics, though. And hopefully our uh, upset stomach will be done by the time we're done there. Okay, here it is. Oh, we got a couple of shamblies over here. We'll deal with them here in a second. Let's get rid of them now. You all so angry. Okay, that's that problem solved. Uh, let's pick the bike up. Uh, just in case they, the zombies decide to beat on a car out here and destroy it. Now, we could, we could encounter runners. We could encounter... Um, I call them spider zombies, but... Uh, ooh. Spider zombies we could encounter. Alright, we made it in pretty much quiet this time. Boom! Sup, yo? That sounds like somebody outside. Okay. Four up, four down. Keep our ass quiet here. Boob shot. Oh.
So she was the one we shot off here. Okay, that's good. Wasted an arrow, but so what? Yeah, there's somebody outside around back. Okay, well, let's go see what kind of party's going on in the bathroom. It's always a party in the bathroom. Especially at a bookstore. It's those nerdy ones, man. You gotta watch out for them. And it's locked. I think whoever that is outside probably heard me. Level 37, man. So Cage was talking about, Cage 848, was talking about people saying that he should be going stealth build. And I put a, posted a comment on the video, he talked about stealth and how it would work and what he would do. I got no problem with a stealth build, but I don't actually build for stealth. Like, the only skills I put in are, are for the extra damage in stealth, that's it. Like, I don't even bother worrying about all the other skills. If you can get sneak damage... That's really all you need. And if things go foobar, you run. Like you would do in any other... In any other, uh... Game. Yeah. These guys are outside that I'm hearing. Alright, let's bring them out here. Got someone coming in there. Ooh. Oh! I'm going to go outside, I think, in a second. Hi, big mama. Manawa mama. Why does it sound like another horde outside? Okay, we got this guy. Don't you snarl at me? Okay, somebody else is in there. Oh, it's you. Not anymore. Oh, they're breaking out of the back room. That's what's happening. Let's eat some uh, bacon and eggs. I want to fight these guys on an empty stomach. Oh, hey, Mo, what's up? Oh, that's somebody outside. You know what? I wonder if they dropped off the roof. That's a good possibility. We're making some pretty good time here. What's up, buddy? Are you the last one in the conga line here? Good night. Okay, you broke out of there. Is that a cop? Nope. Whoops. Oh, there's more. There's three of them. 60 arrows. Lots of arrows. Come on. See, this is the kind of thing you do in a stealth build anyway. Like, on a regular build, in a stealth build, doesn't really matter. There's four of them in there. You know, you run into trouble, you back up, and you just deal with them like this. It's not like you have to deal with everybody in stealth. I mean, like, if you're in a really big POI, then I can understand needing to do that. Oh, hey, buddy, what's up? Are you off the roof, too? Okay, we're going to loot this place in a second, but we're going to go up to the roof first. I got this sneaky suspicion we're dealing with these guys off of the roof. Yeah, I think they all came off of here. Let's just make sure there's nobody left. Alright, now we can loot in peace. Nice!
Really shouldn't be grabbing anything from out here. Should just be focusing on these for now. I didn't even use the pipe bombs. Damn it. Tell you what, if we get a wandering horde, it's going to be pipe bomb time. Paper, 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 paper. Come on, give me something good. Like, give me a rad remover schematic or something. Oh, man. Oh, my God, the paper. <sighs> okay, let's get all the important stuff first. Well, the one good thing about this is we'll be making some good money at the trader. God, really? Nothing. Wasn't expecting anything from there, but I figured I'd give it a shot. Day's almost out. More paper. Oh, we got one schematic. Okay. We already got that. Let's grab these. Like, I'd love to be able to take this apart and bring it back with us, too. They should put books in the game for making your own pop machine and stuff. I call it a pop machine, but you know what I mean. We're not going to get anything good here, are we? Okay, we got. looks like that was a silencer. Silencer schematic. Oh, scope. Is that a silencer schematic? Barrel extender. Well, until we can get some military fiber, we might make some leather armor here. So I'm just going to grab this leather real quick. I'm so disappointed with this place. It was almost not even worth coming here. The fact that we wasted two bacon and eggs to get here and back and stuff. It's just like, I'm going to have to find eggs on the way back. I mean, we got two hours before the sun goes down. So it's not that bad, I guess. But let's use this. Okay, let's see if we can hit up some bacon and eggs on the way back. Alright guys, we needed to find four eggs to make it worth our while. We found ten, which is awesome. Five more bacon and eggs. So, I mean, it was kind of worth our while to go there. Oh, kind of not. Oh, we got twelve. Awesome. And we got pipe bombs. So, I mean, how bad could it really have been? Alright, let's get inside here. Looks like we got some damage on here. Uh, where is our wrench? Yeah, we got a little bit of iron on us. We might as well use it. Fix that a little bit. Now, I think our door... Although, I don't... I think it's forged steel we need to fix the door with. What's it down to? Ah, uh, it's still got lots. They gotta break it out anyway at some point, because this is how, that's how they're coming in here for a horde night anyway. So once it breaks, we'll make another one. Or we'll just fill it in with something until uh, Fortnite starts. Alright, let's get in here. Get stuff organized. So I think that was a pretty good day overall. I mean, it could have been better. But I mean, you know. Look at all this. This stuff is all for sale. I should probably leave it in here. We can get a, go hit up the trader again tomorrow and sell all that stuff off. Know that Trader Joel's is closing soon. Alright. Uh, we've got enough arrows on us, so let's just do that. Uh, actually, the schematics can probably go in here, too. don't even have a workbench to get those going yet, but we'll get that going soon enough. Drop you in there. And the last little bit. Oh, yeah, the plating schematic can go in here, too. So I'm going to make some bacon and eggs tonight. Have that going. Um, ultimate goal is to have a full set of military armor before the... Uh, Horde starts, which I don't know if we'll have, but we'll, we'll try. Um, I don't even know what level it'll be at. But, uh, yeah. So let's get a 24. Let's just get 10 bacon and eggs. Do that. This is now closed. Alright, how much is that going to cost? Three pieces of wood. 
Nice. We shall be well fed. All right, guys, I am going to leave the episode here. I am going to cook up some stuff tonight, get it melted into the forges. We have some iron. We have some brass that we can melt up here. Um, glass we can throw in there. And there's the evening. Um, I'll probably melt up some of these anvils, too. we got too many of them now. Um, and, yeah, let's pull it. Actually, that shouldn't even be in there. What's that doing in there? And then I'll load up for the morning. We'll probably get um, all this stuff sold tomorrow morning. Get a new quest because uh, it'll be day 13. They will be restocked. So hopefully they'll buy some of this other stuff off of us, like these hunting bows and some more of these pistols, reinforced clubs, the hunting rifles. Uh, we'll see how it goes, see what we can sell and what we have to keep. Uh, level 6 pistol, I think we're going to keep. Um, we'll get that repaired and replaced with level 5. Um probably do that tonight Should probably take this out um and yeah we'll just see how to see how it goes all right so I'll leave the episode there if you hope you enjoyed it if you did drop a like if you haven't subscribed please feel free to subscribe and you can drop any comments in the comment section down below until next time we'll see you later